from Raven Elise she is my favorite youtuber and um she just did the tag so I am doing it so this is like my you know type New Year's look you know yeah anyways but um so yeah let's just get into the tag um there are 12 questions I don't remember the questions from her video so they are on my phone um, I have not thought about these to answer them, so I'm just going with the flow. Okay, sorry. I'm just going with the flow. Um, so yeah, let's just answer them. Or, try to answer them. <laughs> uh, alright. So, number one. What was the biggest accomplishment of 2017? Um, I would have to say one of my biggest accomplishments. I'm trying to think. I can't necessarily think of anything like big, big, but one of my biggest accomplishments was definitely moving out of our old apartment into this new townhome that we have. So that was definitely a big um, accomplishment for me because I wanted it, we went for it, we did it, we accomplished it, and we are here. So yes, that was kind of a big accomplishment for me. So. I would say, you know, getting our new apartment was, I guess, the biggest accomplishment of 2017. Um, so, yeah. Uh, let's see. Uh, biggest or best memory of 2017. The best memory of 2017 definitely would be um, our cruise. That was definitely the best memory of 2017. And I'll link it up here if you guys haven't seen it already, but I'm sure you guys have seen it. Um, <laughs> but if you haven't, if you're new here, then it'll be up there for you guys to go watch after this. Um, it's a great video. Um, it was my second time going there, his first time. Um, but yeah, that was definitely the best memory of 2017 going on uh, a Bahamas, or going to the crew going on a cruise to the Bahamas um yeah we're definitely gonna try to do that again for 2018 fingers crossed but yeah uh biggest obstacle of 2017 the biggest obstacle um I don't know I don't know what I would say was the biggest obstacle like honestly we have a lot of or I have a lot of obstacles to go through in life. I wouldn't say getting our apartment was a big obstacle. Like it was a big headache, you know, being nervous, see if we're gonna get it, if we qualify and all that stuff. But it wasn't like a big obstacle because we didn't have to do much, you know? So I don't know what I would say was the biggest obstacle of 2017. Mm, yeah uh top five favorite beauty products of 2017 well i'm not gonna do that in this video because i actually did a video on that of uh, my favorite uh winter or not winter my favorite 2017 uh hair products so i'll leave that up here for you guys to go watch if you haven't watched it already it'll be up there um and i think i did like five or six products in that video so bam right there uh bloopers from 2017 i don't have any bloopers i mean i'm a hot mess all the time so i don't know i don't think anything horrible happened to me in 2017 so yeah uh 
favorite mainstream YouTubers and non-mainstream YouTubers. So, okay. I was going to say, I, like I said, Raven Elise is definitely my favorite YouTuber. But I was going to say, I would think she was mainstream. But I just thought of somebody else that I like that has more subscribers than her. So I'm going to put Raven Elise as the non-mainstream YouTuber that I love. And DK for L, uh, Dear and Ken, they would be the mainstream youtubers because they have like millions like two three four something million subscribers and raven has like um 560,000 somewhere around there uh so yeah those are my two top favorite youtubers uh la 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 regrets of 2017 um, I don't regret anything because, you know, you live and you learn. So, honestly, regrets are more like lessons, you would say. So, I don't regret anything. So, yeah. <laughs> Most memorable phrases from 2017. I don't know, but I feel like I've said lit more this year. I don't know if it just came out in 2017, like, or more people started saying it, but... I know I say lit a lot, like, oh, it's lit. <laughs> um, and I really didn't really say that before. So there's that, I guess, lit. Um, I can't really think of anything else. I know, like, a whole bunch of hot mess stuff that people say, but, yeah, I don't really say a lot of craziness that everyone else says. Um, most embarrassing moment of 2017. Isn't that, like, the same thing? Didn't I read that? No, I didn't. Oh, bloopers. I guess that's like the same thing. Most embarrassing moment of 2017, which like I just said, kind of like the bloopers thing. I really don't have anything that I can think of. So we're going to skip that. Lessons learned. Um, patience is the key. Like I was, I would say that be very patient and like a lot of things. Um, cause I'm not a very patient person. I will admit that. Um, so I would say, yeah, patience is key. I'm going to try to be, you know, more patient with things in 2018. Um, and yeah, live up to your means or live by your means, whatever you're how you want to put it. Um, like don't try to live a certain way because someone else lives that way. Like, live how you can live. Live how you want to live. Don't live for anyone else but yourself. Um, confidence is key. Uh, I say, you know, be as confident as you can in your own self. Love yourself. Because no one else is going to love you for you. Um, so, yeah. There's that. Um, my goals for 2018 definitely even though we just like i feel just moved here uh definitely get a house because we wanted a house before we even moved here but stuff didn't work out you know like i said patience is key be patient things happen when they happen for a reason so this year when our lease is up i definitely do want to move out and get us a house we do want to purchase a house um so that definitely is a very big goal for 2018 so i guess in next year's video we'll see if we accomplish that that'd be something to look forward to um but that's like one of the biggest goals we have for this year is definitely to get our house next year um which obviously that starts this year because our lease is up in november so yeah um what else i that's like literally the biggest goal we have like our top goal I can't think of anything else other than like you know make more money live better live a happier life I definitely want to lose weight so maybe we'll make this like a weight loss channel also you know maybe I'll have like a weight loss journey on here for you guys because I definitely want to be healthier you know look healthier for myself not for anyone else um so yeah that is honestly a goal for me to to lose some weight be healthier live a healthier lifestyle um 
And yeah, so that's about it. And then last but not least, what am I looking forward to in the new year? Then um, what I'm looking forward to, I would say, is uh, growth. Honestly, I would say growth is like our is the top thing I'm looking for. Not necessarily like with money, like, but um, like value in self, I guess I would say, like just value self more have more confidence have more growth in like our relationship you know have more growth in our jobs and you know stuff like that just grow prosper and all that stuff um yeah <laughs> so that was about it for this tag like i said it is called the about a year ago tag and um i hope you guys liked it like this isn't the first video i've done in 2018 which i know most people do this as their first video 2018 but you know i do some backwards around here <laughs> but uh regardless i did it um it's still the beginning of the year today is i don't even know what today is but it's still the beginning of the year whatever we're still in january so um yeah, but like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. Like, comment, and subscribe. Sus um, comment some of you guys' uh, New, Year New Year resolutions down below. And let me know what you guys' goals are for 2018. What are some things that you accomplished in 2017 that you're happy about. And yeah, all that good stuff. Let me, uh, like I said, let me know down in the comment section below. And, uh, happy new year to you guys. I don't think I have said that yet. Happy new year to you guys. I hope you guys were all safe and enjoyed your new year. And I am glad you guys are still with me that, uh, were with me last year. And, yeah, that's about it. Like I said, I love you guys. And I'll see you in my next video.